Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix this error that is please close interception before starting the game. So if you're receiving this error with Apex Legends game, then please follow the steps shown in this video. So to fix this error, you have to uninstall this interception file. So maybe in past while installing any drivers, you might have installed this interception file on the computer. And you have to uninstall this. Now, if you don't find this interception file, and if you don't know how to uninstall it, in that case, if you don't find this interception, in that case, you have to install it, then you have to uninstall it. So in Google search, in search, in Google search, just type in how to install interception file. Now you will see all the instruction in Google, and then you can install this interception file. Now, once you install it, then you have to install it using this command. So if this interception file is in C drive, so for example, I'll show you if if I open C drive, if you have this install interception file in C drive, in that case, type in CMD in Windows search box, make or I click on command prompt app and then click on run as administrator. Make sure that you open this as an administrator and then click on yes to allow. And then you have to paste the command on command prompt window. So copy this. Yeah. And then paste it over here and then hit the enter key. Here you can see it's installed. Now you have to uninstall this. So copy this. and then paste it over here, hit the enter key. And here you can see uninstall. Now you have to restart your computer. Restart is a must after this. And after the system restart, you can check. You should not receive the error. Now, if you have this interception file in downloads folder, in that case, you have to again install it. At the end, you have to type in install, install it. Then you have to run this command to uninstall it. Follow the same process, but instead of your username, just type in your username. So whenever you download any file, if it goes to uh, download folder. So this may be the location over here. So you can just write down your username over here. And then you can you, you have to inst install it first and then you have to uninstall it and then restart your computer and then check. Now still you are receiving the error message. Then if you have these application or tools running, you have to close these application or tools. So you can just make a right click on the start menu and then go to task manager. For example, I don't have all the application, but I'll give you some examples. So if you have this daemon tools, make a right click, then click on end task. If you have this make a right click, click on end task to launch the game. Now, if you have this REWASD running, so if you have it running, make a right click and then click on end task. If you have this, Astro Burn, DS4 Windows. So find this. So I have DS4 Windows running, make a right click, end task. If you have face it, anti cheat running, make a right click, click on end task. If you have this Riot Vanguard, Logitech. Also, if you have this auto hotkey running on your computer, you can close this. Make sure it is not running over here also. And you can also end it from the task manager if you find it in the task manager. So I don't have it running. If you find it, close it. And if that does not work, you can even uninstall auto hotkey and then restart your computer and then check. Now also you have to disable these from the device manager. So if you have these services or uh, device running in device manager, uh, make a right click on the start menu, go to device manager. And for daemon tools, this is just an example. So open device manager and then exp expand uh, storage controller. And you might see daemon tools over here. I have only one uh, over here. If you see two daemon tools, make a right click, then click on disable device, click on yes. Later on, whenever you need this application, you can enable it. Expand this universal bus controller make a right click then click on disable device later on when you want it you can enable it also if you have any other um, 
tools running in device manager you have to disable it from the device manager so if you find one of these in device manager also uh, if you have this xvdd scsi mini port or daemon or corsair in device manager running you can make a right click disable it so if you have this xvdd scsi mini port you can make a right click you can disable it then uh, relaunch the game and then check you can always enable this afterwards and then check if that does not work you can even uninstall these application from your computer restart your computer and then launch the game also make sure this is not running over here so any other third party application logitech created so close everything so also close third party application which you are not using also end services process services or process from the task manager if you have vlc codec or wallpaper engine msi apps intel driver update unplug all the external devices which you are not using so try this and then you can launch the game and then check you should not receive this error anymore so that'll be all thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel